Okay, so the source of funds and source of wealth is something that you will see in AML KYC circles. Uh, it is common with the profile. It really depends on the type of client. So you have a source of funds for a retail person. That will be the source of funds of John is his job, his employment, uh, where he makes $90,000 a year. He has some shares. He has some 401k. Uh, you know, that is his source of funds. His wealth is his salary, uh, his mortgage, uh, some assets that were given to him. That's individual. Once you start getting at a more institutional or private investor vehicle, it's, it's a completely different. Source of funds kind of remain similar. What has the person got in the last one year or so that is used to basically fund their lives per se? All right, have they got investment income? Do they have revenue? Do they have businesses? Now, at a higher level, it's much harder to verify this and you have to ride all out, you know, look at their employment, look at their investments, average out their investments, see if it's verifiable, see if it's plausible, okay? But the source of wealth is a completely different ballgame. You have to prove how someone came to their wealth. And this is why KYC is getting even more complicated now because you have to prove how they came to their wealth. So if someone's with $100 million, you have to prove over a 40-year period within a certain percentage of how they came to it. So if they, they were worth $100,000, no, they were worth $100 million in, in 2020, what were they worth when they first, when they finally graduated I know, college in 1960? Okay, so they had a, they, they got a business. How did they get that business? Oh, $1,000 loan from their parents in 1960. All right, cool, cool, cool. What happened in 1963? Oh, it was successful. They hired more people and they bought this. Okay, what happened then? Oh, 1967, sold the business and bought into this business. And you have to do that the whole entire way. And that can take days to write out a source of wealth now. So the source of funds, and the source of wealth is basically verifying. You've verified the customer with the KYC and, who, and then source of wealth, source of funds is now basically verifying whether their story matches up. And before you could just bullshit your way through a bit or have minimal evidence, but now you need to have evidence, you need to verify, you need to tell the whole story. And that's why this role is changing and that's why it's exciting and that's why there's a lot of jobs right now and that's why customer due diligence is truly, you know, an exciting job for the future.